Yeah, I know. I'm watching. Hey, what's going on? It's your boy Big Shell. Welcome to another edition of uh, Fighters Fury. I'm here with the man, the myth, the <laughs> legend. Free one up. What's going on, baby? What's up, man? How you doing? I'm good. I'm good. I'm doing good, man. So we just sitting there. Uh, we at the game yard in Garden City. And uh, can you tell the people out there who doesn't really know about Free One Up who hell the Free One Up is? Um, uh, I'm just a guy that, you know, from Detroit. I like to play Street Fighter for real, <laughs> and happen to have a YouTube channel, you know. And uh, I'm not really good at talking about myself. So that's, you know, okay, but, that's fair enough. Yeah, for those who don't know, he has happens to have a YouTube channel. Yeah, that's I'm that's. Have a how um, how many subs is there, sir? What is that like eight thousand one hundred? Last time I checked, it was just like yesterday. Eight thousand. <laughs> All right, and uh, just so to. Much. This, uh, this interview is kind of special because um, before there was Fighters Fury, there was Lance Free One Up Cryer. He's the one who went out and interviewed like all the main guys or whatnot, and he's the man. So Small interviews. Hey, small interviews. Interviews yeah. is, interviews does, you know what I'm saying? So, um, speaking of that, which uh, interview um, did you have the most fun with as far as? Uh, most fun? Well, it had to be probably. Justin Wong, you know, in, in the, uh, you know, the EMP members out at Seasons Beatings 4, mm -hmm. you know, like, I was kind of nervous to just go in here, like, because I don't know, I wasn't sure if they knew who I was or not, you know, they just kind of, I just wanted to go up there and ask them, like, man, can I get an interview real quick? It was, it, I wanted to make it real quick, you know, so I didn't want to waste their time, because it was, like, in the middle of a tournament, it was all getting called and everything, but, yeah, it was, it was real nice of them to actually do that for me. So how's Justin Wong in person? Is he a cool cat? He cool. I mean, I, don't, I haven't really seen anything, you know, that would say he's arrogant or anything like that. But he's cool. From what I've seen, he was cool. He was like, he just agreed right off, you know. And, you know, he's just like that, <laughs> you know, just like the rest of you know. What about uh, Love You Joe? He probably was the uh, nicest out of all of them. I would not say the other ones wasn't nice, but he probably, you know. He'll sit there and have a conversation with you, you know. He'll start a conversation with you and everything. It was, it was cool. He was a nice dude. Um, and, and my man, IFC Yipes. Yipes. <laughs> yipes, I have to say, he's the coolest out of all of them. Not, you know, he's the coolest, but he's kind of, uh, he says what he wants. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> he does say exactly, what he wants, exactly. you know. So, man, so. so um, he's cool, though. It's like, it was cool to meet him again. With your uh, YouTube uh, page, did you just imagine it'd be this successful? No. <laughs> I just uh, I just had nothing to do one day, you know. <laughs> I wouldn't even think about putting no videos out. It was just, I just wanted to mess around with people and, like, make fun of people. You know, that was it. Then people just started, I don't know, just started watching. Then, <laughs> and all of a sudden, I just fought DSP and, you know, all this stuff. And it, it kind of went up a little bit more after that. And ever since then, it just kind of kept going. Okay. How but it was going up. I don't want to attribute everything to DSP because it was a lot of it with me because it was going up a little bit slowly by myself. It just started going up a little faster when after I fought DSP. You know, I don't want him to be like, oh, you know, <laughs> my, your subscribers is off mine. Like, How do you feel about <laughs> Right, you had to excuse me. He kind of nervous. See, see, this is what happens I when never you. Get interviewed. This is what happens when you interview the in, the interviewer. It is, they just they this just you know meltdown. <laughs> okay, how do you feel about the uh, Michigan Street Fighter Four players up here? I think we have some amazing talent up here, which is one of the reasons why I was, I'm always trying to put them out there, like trying to get them to make videos and everything. It's like we got. We got Antoine Ortiz, we got Checkmate, we got Wolf Chrome, the Viper player, you know, you know him or not, the Viper player. We got a whole lot of unknown players up here that's like pretty much on the same level, you know. And that's pretty much the reason why I haven't won a tournament at all, ever, you know. But it's like when you got them guys up here all the time, it's like you just, you know, what you going to do? But we got a lot of talent, a lot of talent up here. We got a strong Street Fighter 4 team. And they did pretty good at Seasons Beatings. And it was Twine, Wolf Crone, and Checkmate. They played against the EMP members. They didn't, they, the EMP members won, but it wasn't like no pushover thing like that. You know, it was, they gave them a run, like a real good run, you know. 
Okay. Okay.